So you think this incident sparked an awareness of something? Yes. Can you tell me what you are aware of exactly? My coming death. I've been noticing things, you know, like it's little coincidences. Every morning I wake up, I look at the clock and it says the same time. 11.34. At first, I thought it was a prank. Something that could be done to fool me, you know, but why? I mean, and how? Like, technically, how could somebody pull something like that off? So, it's when I realized that all of my clocks are connected to the internet to keep them synced with the official clock. The official clock? Yeah, the official clock. You know, the official clock on the internet that keeps the central time. And who's monitoring that anyways? The U.S.? Well, that's when I thought the government was watching me. Why would the government do that? I don't know. I, I even came up with my own theory. And I thought that, all right, maybe it was just some pissed off Republicans upset that I voted Democrat and betrayed the values of the conservative neocon movement. And uh, they're upset and wanted to follow me and torture me using some crazy Nazi techniques that involved the clocks, the internet, hidden cameras, and cable TV commercials. Cable television commercials. The, the commercials, the cable TV commercials send me messages. I mean, they talk to me all the time. They love me, yet they threaten me. Matter of fact, it was your commercial that brought me here to make the appointment. But why? So you can kill me? That makes no sense. I know. Because afterwards, when I came to the final conclusion, that this is all just a test from God. Why on earth would God do that? Well, because I have sinned. I mean, I'm, I am impure. That's a silly thing. Well, I know it to be true. Really? Yes. How come? Well, because I know what's going to happen next. What's going to happen next? You kill me. I am not going to kill you. Well, then I pass the test. Why is that a test? When I made the appointment to come see you, I saw the address on the building. It says 1134 Bird Road. You're the last piece of this puzzle. And I could have run away from this, but no. This was a test of my faith. I decided to follow through with this, and I did. Well, I'm not going to kill you, but let me ask you something. What? Why do you think that God is testing you and not the devil? I don't know. The testament of God is not one that is deceiving to his followers. Is it not written in goodwill and love for humanity? Uh, I mean, I, yeah, I guess. Maybe it was the devil testing you all along. Maybe. Maybe. You, you should, should have never, never come here.
Yes. The answer is through that door. Yes. It was here, waiting for me. Whatever it was. It was here to give me the answer I was looking for. And then it was gone. I wasn't surprised when I woke up from it all again at 11.34. My life continues as if everything that happened that afternoon was just a bad dream. I'm not even sure if I'm still dreaming or if I'm already dead. I'm not sure if it matters anyways because when I look at stars at night, I'm looking at things that are already 